What is up, everybody? Welcome back to Real Time. I'm Rob. I'm Bryce. And I'm Zah. And today we are back with Real Timer Monthly Movie number five. This month, you guys voted for Crazy Stupid Love, and I am super pumped to watch this. I have seen it before. I've seen it a bunch of times, honestly. The last time being probably around two or three years ago. So I do remember pretty much all of it. It I I really like this movie. Uh, it has a great cast. Steve Carell, Ryan Gosling, Emma Stone, they're all Don't spoil it they're for all me. great. We already know. Uh, we already know. I'm pumped to watch it again. They've never seen it. It's really funny. I, I think they're gonna really like it as well. I mean I'm really I love the cast. Steve Carell is mm, it's the I Steve Carell. Up. I eat him up. I debut love on the channel. Is it right? Maybe. I love Steve Carell on The Office. I mean, that is by far a top three show ever for me. Like that was gotta one be. I mean, it's so freaking good. Gotta yeah. be top three. Yeah. Have you not watched it? No, guys, I've never seen The Office. Bryce is needs to watch The Office. I don't know what he's doing. That is something that you can just like watch in yeah, the, the background. background. It's such a good show. Oh, I would, Hilarious. I probably watched The Office like all the seasons like seven or eight times over. Like it is just immaculate. But yeah, enough about The Office. Uh, they're at ryan gosling emma stone they're both fantastic let's get back emma to michael stone, scott though emma stone emma stone easy a we watched that on the channel yeah and we also watched ryan gosling in what, the notebook oh yeah, the notebook. yeah. Yep. we did both, so both this solid movies uh-huh so steve carell is the true <laughs> the notebook being way better <laughs> All right, guys, well, that is pretty much it before we do get into this movie. If you do like all of our movie reactions, please leave a like, drop a comment, and subscribe. Over 81% of you guys are not subscribed, so please take two seconds. Hit the sub button. It helps us out a lot. We really appreciate that. Check out all the links in our description as well. We got the Patreon, Discord, all of our social medias down there, so check that out, as well as the address to our PO box. Send us something to be opened up on camera, like everything you see behind us right now for our show, Mail Time. And with all that being said, guys, we're going to get right into this movie. Real timer, monthly movie number five. Crazy Stupid Love. Let's do it. Oh, man. Dude, well, these movies make me feel oh, so sad. New balances. Those I got a pair of those. Steve! <laughs> Steve! Oh, I know the yeah, girl. I, she's a very famous she's, actress. She's I the, just forgot. She's the mom in um The Visit. I want a divorce. Whoa! <laughs> that is not what he was expecting to hear. Look at Steve. I love him. I feel like he always, he always plays like a sweet guy who gets like stepped all over. Ah, oh. give me forty year old virgin vibes. Ah, broke the picture. It's a sign. He likes her dad. I think it's her dad. Is he sad? Or is that a babysitter? Yeah, I think it might he, be a babysitter. I think it might be. <clears throat> Dude, look at him. <laughs> Almost 25 years of marriage and you have nothing to say? You dropped it. You dropped the bomb. In a restaurant? And you were ordering. In public? Pretty bad time. Hey, Robbie, have you seen Molly's homework? Get, get out! Oh my god. Close the door! What was happening? Robbie, I'm really sorry and I didn't see anything. Robbie, what were you doing? Oh my god. Oh, I feel like... I know that kid. Was he was he doing That's definitely the babysitter. I don't think so. She was asking if she's a babysitter. Is she? Spoiler alert. I Fuck. slept with someone. Oh. Another bomb, huh? Jeez, they're so subtle. Why is she just saying this shit? David Lynn Hagen. David Lynn Hagen. From work. You met him at the Christmas party? The one Please with stop. The, the last person in the world that I wanna hurt is. If you keep cow, talking, but, I'm gonna get out of the I car. Think... <laughs> I'm just gonna get out of the car? Oh, yeah. oh, much, much, really <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Yeah. He actually just gets oh out of the gosh. car. I mean, what would you do? Like, said if you keep talking, I'm gonna get out of the car. I'll leave tonight. I'll sign wherever you want. Just please stop talking about it. I mean, yeah. Why would you say like it's this guy? You know him at the Christmas party from work. He was pretty good, actually. Yeah. Like what? Might as well just say that too. I'm sorry you had to see that. <laughs> yeah. You know, I should have knocked. I have a guess of what he's doing. You're probably right with your yes. Just for the record, I think about you while I do it. What? <laughs> Not. Doesn't help the situation. No one in this movie knows how to, like, have a conversation normally. Yeah. I'm pretty sure you're my soulmate. Listen, Robin. Great timing. Oh my god. Well, 
Mrs. Weaver said she wanted a divorce, and I jumped out of the car. <laughs> Dad? Oh. oh, hey, buddy. I didn't see you standing there. You're getting a divorce? Mm -hmm. Well, Great way for a child to find out. Sweetheart, let's, Listen, let's go to bed, Why okay? don't you grab your cut? I'll drive you home. Everything's okay. Mommy and Daddy do not love each other anymore. I love hey. this thing. I really do. And given the opportunity, yes, I would have his babies. <laughs> Seriously. Conan O'Brien. What? Conan O'Brien. I don't know about that one, Chief. It's the red hair connection. My life is not PG-13. Oh, it so is. No, it's not. Yes, it is. You've never left LA. You pass the bar, you're gonna be like... There he is. Ryan Gosling. That dude looked at me, dude. My knees I would buckle. melt. I'd melt. I can't even see him. You can just tell from the, the swagger who this is. Dwayne the Rock Johnson. Yeah. He is funny. He looks like a carrot, honey. He looks like a carrot. Oh my god. Who is this man? He looks like a carrot. Conan O'Brien. <laughs> my friend um, Hannah here thinks he's sexy. That's weird because I think that your friend Hannah is really sexy. <laughs> oh! <laughs> He's going right, right for it. Do you think you're a little old to be using cheesy pickup lines? Objection. Leading the witness. <laughs> wow, Hannah, you're really wearing that dress like you're doing it a favor. Uh, oh my <laughs> god. Dude, he's the smoothest man alive. I mean, there's lots of beautiful women in this bar, your friend included. Hi. I love you. <laughs> I guarantee you this, you're never going to regret going home with that guy from the bar that one time that was a total tomcat in the set. Wow. Whoa, dude. Total he... tomcat. He's so smooth with it. He really is. I'm gonna just like start walking up to girls at the bar and just play this clip of the movie. Yeah. Be, like, just put it in front of your face. Imagine this is me saying it. Uh, I think it'll work. <laughs> Should I get my car or yours? Should I pull the car around? Have you been drinking? I'll drive. Liz, <laughs> coming! Damn. Didn't work. You're really nice. That's very nice. And um, I like Miss Weaver. I like her a lot. If she wants to divorce you what then i think she's batshit crazy <laughs> okay he does seem like a sweet guy i've developed like a little could you crush. do me a favor would you not mention to your parents that miss weaver and i are no she was like a, was she about to say she has a crush on this yeah. man <laughs> he was like all right well like don't tell your parents that i'm getting a divorce another box of cranberry Another vodka cranberry? Drinking some vodka crayons. You a fan? I like them. On the occasion, maybe. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Hey, it's gonna be cringe. What? what? My wife is having intercourse with someone who is not me. <laughs> Jesus. That is a stranger, Steve Carell. You wouldn't ignore me if I were David Lindhagen. Oh my god. Ah, oh, it's sad. It's sad. I hate this. I hate <laughs> this so much. Anxiety. <sighs> wow. Gay. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan Gosling surrounded by women. Gay. Gay. Can I back that thing out of the driveway for you? Oh, no. I'll be fine. You have trouble in reverse is all. When I get settled, the kids can come and take a look at my new place. I think I'm having a midlife crisis, my dude. She does not seem stable. No, not not right now. No. There's a a, a turnoff valve for the sprinklers you know, over last there. Last week, you know, when I told you that I had to work late, I really went to see the new Twilight movie by myself. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. <laughs> that is so it strange. Was so bad. <laughs> <laughs> why would you put yourself through that? I don't know when you and I stopped being us. Do you? Maybe it's when you screwed David Lenhagen. Mmm. Getting right to the point. Like she did. Yeah, that's a good response. Back here again. Yeah, back he's gonna bar. be he's gonna be on a big bender. Drinking some vodka crayons. I at think the bar. he's gonna get Emma Stone. There's Jacob. You need to get some help on your game from him. He <laughs> 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 got nervous. Sorry, I'm late. I oh yeah, oh, he's really definitely in some stuff. Me? Yeah, he's in. I'm just glad you're here. He's the clown in um. Billy Madison. American Horror Story. Uh, you know, when you don't see Is something he? coming, 
Freak show? You're the one who said it. I think he is. He can't be friends anymore with him? Oh. Are you breaking up with me, Bernie? Or ending the friendship. Bernie. Bernie. Ah. Oh. Friendship over. That's so depressing. He's losing everyone. You know a word that is not used very often anymore? Cuckold. <laughs> I'm cuckold. Oh, <laughs> he's no. I'm a cuckold. David Linhagen took my wife and slept with her. Please. He Please loves stop. I think I've heard David Linhagen so much. David Linhagen. David Linhagen. <laughs> cuckold. He made a cuckold out of me. <laughs> Say it again. He made a cuckold out of me. Look him up. <laughs> Come over here. Can you give me five minutes with this Ryan guy? Gosling has summoned you. You must respond. Oh my god. Jacob Palmer. Cal Weaver. Let me buy you a drink, Cal. Thanks, I already have a drink. Hey, Cal, sit down. <laughs> I'd like to buy you a drink. <laughs> <laughs> Guess what? My wife is having an affair with David Lindhagen. David Lindhagen. Lin David Lindhagen, I know. How do I know that? I'm a total stranger. How would I know something so intimate but about you're your wife? Screaming David Lindhagen screwing your wife, too. No. No, that's not the case. <laughs> That I've heard Cal for the past two nights. <laughs> it's all anybody's heard. You just fucking talking about, about David Linhog and all night. Badgering people with this sad sack loser sob story, and I don't understand why. No, I don't need this crap. Now sit down. All right. <laughs> all right. Okay, I'll listen to you. And you need to hear the truth, okay? Okay. Cal, would you take that straw out of your mouth? <laughs> just <laughs> drink it out of the glass. <laughs> You're sitting there with a supercuts haircut. You're getting drunk on watered down vodka cranberries like a 14 year old girl. <laughs> and you're wearing a 44 when you should be wearing a 42 regular. Honestly, I don't know if I should help you or I should euthanize you. Ryan Gosling keeping it 100 with him right now. You seem like a nice guy. I want to help you. I'm going to help you rediscover your manhood. Let's do it. That's awesome. Where'd we lose the manhood at? We're going to find it. We are. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. We're gonna get your manhood back, Cal. When we're done, this wife of yours, she's gonna rue the day she ever decided to give up on you. Yes, sir. Actually, Ryan. a very, very kind guy. Ryan Gosling, Sensei. Does he want anything in return? Why are you doing this? Maybe you remind me of someone. You in or you out? I'm in. I would take the deal. Doesn't have anything to lose, right? Take that deal. Uh, a little toast. I would like to thank you all for coming to uh, Hannah Banana's goodbye party. Oh, a little goodbye party. I'm my girl here. This is Ryan Gosling's competition. I know, I know oh man, I don't know who who's better right looking, here. right? And I can't. That's can a tough, tough call. A he seems like just as cool yeah. of a guy as Ryan Gosling's character too. No, no. Did you hear that? Oh, he's gonna propose. So is that like his? Her boyfriend? Yeah, I think so. Oh my. Look at this guy. I'm like blinded, bro. I need to put on some sunglasses. I think Steve Carell's better looking. Oh, get real. He's making eating that pizza look so good. These are my 407s. Oh, they're 407s. Oh, well, in that Can case, I yeah. that makes him good. Chuck him over. For a lot of support. Right. <laughs> are you Steve Jobs? What? Hold on a second. Are you the billionaire owner of Apple Computers? <laughs> no. Are you Steve Jobs? Okay. Well, in that case, you got no right to wear New Balance sneakers ever. Those are the only two Come qualifications. <laughs> Slap him in the face. You have to either be in a fraternity or Steve Jobs to wear New yeah. Balances. I'm telling you, I'm a stand going to fall in love with Steve Carell. <laughs> that response. The Velcro wallet, ugh. <laughs> I didn't even realize that's what that was. We're getting some hella new clothes. Get under your eyes, it's starting to look like you have this ball sack. <laughs> ball sack, guys. It does. <laughs> <laughs> he confirms it. Okay, that's an upgrade. I don't know about the jacket. Yeah, the jacket may be a bit much. Did you sleep with him? Jesus, God! What? Whoa, huh. whoa, whoa. <laughs> what? <laughs> what are you even saying? <laughs> <laughs> he has no idea how to react. You opened your mouth. Tiffany started doubting whether she Confidence. wanted to sleep with you or not. That's probably the meanest thing anyone's ever said. <laughs> 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 you 
your wife cheated on you because you lost sight of who you are as a man, as a husband, and probably as a lover. That's me. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely a lot meaner. <laughs> <laughs> How many women you've been with? Sexually? Yeah, no. I mean, breakdance fighting. <laughs> one. Not at one time. <laughs> Not how many in total? One. One girl. I think we should start approaching women tonight. Are you ready to go? I think you've already started that, Jacob. Not as a we. We have to go we. I'd be nervous to walk up there. What's your name? Amy Johnson. Amy Johnson? <laughs> I'm Jacob Palmer. How you doing? I'm great. Good. I'm Cal. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm Cal. <laughs> Wouldn't touch you. My life depended on it. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. I hope there's so much more to, of him talking to women. <laughs> I'm crying already, bro. I have this friend. And he thinks that you're way too pretty to be. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. You wanna get out of here? <laughs> He's just watching. How are you doing a slag? Mildly sexy, but unbelievably cute thing that you're doing. Oh, wow. he kind of used his oh. line. <laughs> He's just sitting over there. Molly, who's six at the time, can't find Mr. Bubba. <laughs> <laughs> Wanna get out of here? Have a good night. Is it, I feel like he's told like six different girls you wanna get out of here. These are different nights. Oh, these are all different. Oh, okay, yeah. Oh, oh, who is this? That's a bombshell right there. Eyeing him up. Is she walking to him? <laughs> what is this face? <laughs> uh, this is your bill. <laughs> wow. He thought he was on to something there. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Oh, I feel bad. He's gonna go broke. You have a second. Is that oh, David? Hey, David, no. I'm, I'm swamped. You've been avoiding me. No, I haven't. You ran in the other direction. You Do you recognize that? That guy? I think. That's Kevin Bacon. Oh, oh really? I don't know who that yeah. is. But loose. I, I had no intention of falling for a married woman, but we were having lunch, and I'm, I'm on this accountant who's waking up every morning excited to go to work, and that just does not happen for accountants, ever. Facts. Can you, can you attest to that, Bryce? I can attest to that. For some reason, I feel like they're going to fall for each other. <laughs> He's trying really hard. I mean, it makes way more sense for her to start to, for her to like him. I mean, yeah, I, I would stop texting her, bud. The A they're both wearing. I think it stands for asshole. Not what you say in school. Because they fell in love and love is for stupid assholes. <laughs> And this book is just about a bunch of assholes. Oh my God, relaxed, Robbie, please. Sorry about all the assholes. Apologize. Apology accepted. You know what else might work? A swear jar. You know, a quarter of a curse word. Yeah. Swear jar. We'll get a swear jar going. We should get a jam jar. A jar of jam? <laughs> That'd be good. <laughs> Tastes really good. The war between the sexes is over. And we won. Even though we won, they still deserve our respect. You know, make them feel beautiful. Oh my wow. goodness. My schwanz is in your face for 20 minutes. It's not bothering you. We got a bigger problem. Okay, it bothers me. I don't care. <laughs> Please. Why are we doing this? You don't like something? <laughs> he looks say, like he's being tortured. Right now. Lynn Hagen, he certainly took what he wanted, didn't he? What are you passing out? Oh no. Oh boy. <laughs> Why would you just let him fall there? On the peep. On his peep. You want me to hit on her? No, I want to hit on her. The one behind her. Oh. She's a total fox, right? Mm -hmm. She's hunting. She's just looking for an opportunity is that, to settle. Is that is that Peter Park? Is that Peter Parker's aunt in Spider Man? That's I have no clue. What do I do? Do I ask them to come home with me? No, you tell them to come home with you. They have no choice in the matter. It is your choice, and they are so overjoyed to have had the opportunity to make sweet, sweet love to you. <laughs> wow, he's got it all figured out now. You Miyagi, Mr. Miyagi. Huh. Take your ring off. Go. <laughs> Ryan Gosling created yeah. him. Like, if my friend was pushing me towards a girl, I would totally be like, fuck, I can't go up there. What I would agree. you do? I, I would not like it. 
By the way, that's definitely the the aunt or whatever. Yeah, from... that's uh, Marissa Tomei is the actress. I've name. seen photos of them saying how hot she was from Spider Man. Yeah, attractive woman. So can I buy you a drink, Kate? Oh uh, no, thank no, you. No, you don't ask. I'm gonna buy you a drink anyway. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm five years sober. Nah, uh, she's joking. What can I get for you? Nothing. Nothing. Go away. We're good. Please don't come back ever. Is she actually sober? Yep. Five years sober. Seriously, what do, what do you do? Seriously, what do you do? Oh, no, oh, man. No, a little too much. <laughs> oh, Was that a, is that a meme? I feel like I've seen that before. Mm. I'm a teacher. Boring. Come on. This is not <laughs> oh, good. This is good. good. Uh, <laughs> Uh, I studied at Oxford University. <laughs> <laughs> That's boring. I was supposed to say that you are the perfect combination of sexy and cute, which is actually something that I used to say to my wife, but now it's become corrupted. <laughs> the phrase is corrupted now. I'm just, it's all sweat under here. Oh. This is just sweat. From is this going to work? And I'm looking at your breast. <laughs> What's oh my. that about? I think I'm the perfect combination of sexy and cute. That's all she heard. That's what you picked up. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh. We're back at the apartment, baby. Hasn't had sex with another girl, huh? Dumpy. That I had to move into after my wife left. Oh, you're being so honest. <laughs> <laughs> he is being really off honest. Tell me more. Oh my god. She's uh, like, I feel like there's not a lot of girls oh like this. Oh my god. <laughs> Did you see hear what he just said? No. What? He said, I'm just a little bit worried that you have AIDS. That's <laughs> <laughs> so fucked up. What do you want to do with me? Oh, I want to show you off to my ex-wife make her really jealous. I feel like there's not a lot of girls that are going to act like this, huh? You found the one. Oh my gosh. Wow. Call me. Okay. You think they did it? Yeah. Oh! <laughs> He's a new man. <laughs> Look at this guy. That is a great dress. Where'd you get that? Thank you. Oh, he he's spitting now. I think he's got the riz now. Oh, I love this. He's just doing what Jacob taught him how to do. Jeez, bro. He's probably up his oh, body count. Oh, look at this guy. He's taking all the game. He's like, ah, oh, I've taught him well. Look at this frown on your face. What is that? He's so serious. What, it's serious to kiss me? It's supposed to be fun. Oh my god, it's gonna be hard work. Why don't you just stop? <laughs> what? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Their relationship is so funny. Here we go, bro. Behold! Jessica Riley, you are my soulmate. The love of my life. I have marked myself with a scarlet J. Oh. Oh my god, this is so bad. I learned to love me, I promise. No, I won't. Just because I'm four years younger than you. Because I love somebody else. He's older. You know I'll kill him if he hurts you. Robbie, please, bro. They're gonna end up together. This dude painted a J on his chest and took his shirt off in front of everybody at school. Unbuttoned it. Unbuttoned it. Ugh. Oh. Dude, you gotta admire the effort. The dedication is there. Uh oh. Who's she eyeing? Fucking David Lindhagen, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it was a nightmare. <laughs> he has nightmares about David Lindhagen cutting his grass. <laughs> Is he in his backyard? Yeah. Oh, he just takes takes care like the garden. Gotta do the yard work, man. Somebody's gotta do it. I think he's doing it so David doesn't have to. <laughs> she's my soulmate, you know? She doesn't even care. But she's your soulmate, right? Yeah. Oh. Well, you just don't give up on her, right? Why not? He has all the game now. Oh, he said you did. Oh, shit. That? Watch it. Either you love her or you don't, and I know you do. I'm serious, Dad. I just need some inspiration right now. Right? Go get her back. I can Probably. Like... It's good energy, but the real world is not always black and white like he thinks it is. I like single Mr. Weaver. 
It's true. Yeah, I, I, I do feel, too. I, he found himself again a little bit. Like he has this new energy about him. You look great. Thanks. You That's what you're missing out on. Thanks. Handsome ass Steve Carell. But the other option is Kevin Bacon. Nah. I got Steve. You seen anybody? A lot of people. Me? Mm -hmm. Quite a few. Oh, mm. well, you know, well, you hear things, you know, so. Yeah, well. Such an awkward answer. Wow. I don't think he could have said it worse. I miss you, Em. I made an effort when we were younger, didn't I? I just, I don't know. I guess I got lazy. I got... Complacent. I got boring, is what I got. I don't like how he's blaming himself, though. I don't think you should... Yeah, cheated on him. Yeah, she's cheated. I'm really mad at you for what you did. But I'm mad at myself, too. Because I should not have jumped out of that car. I should have fought for you. Because you fight for your soulmates. Taking some advice from his son. What my 13-year-old son tells me. He's a really strange kid. He scares the shit out of me. <laughs> well, he scares the shit out of me. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Weaver? Oh, no. oh, oh God. <laughs> no way in hell. I want to show you off to my ex wife. You've met before, yes? She's your wife, Pia. How convenient. Mm. Oh. Uh, not who uh, he thought he'd be seeing today. We, I think we met at last year's parent teacher conference, wasn't it? Spitting straight <laughs> bullshit out. Yeah, this girl has a, has a screw loose, huh? She's going to go off. Oh my god. You're familiar with this word, Mrs. Weaver. Yes, I am. And I've spoken to Prince Asshole. Asshole. About... As in someone who tells a woman that he'll call and never does. Oh. As in someone who allows a woman to go downtown for 45 minutes because he's nervous. Oh. Ew. All right, all right, Ew. All right, all right, all right. You know what? You know what? No. Mm -hmm. uh, what the fuck? Why is she licking her lips? She's an alcoholic. Oh, oh come on, on dude. Oh, jeez, dude. Yeah, I did. Also lied about did. saying this is his wife. Our son's eighth grade English what do you mean? I know, I know. And I, I like he said, this is my wife. Still, they're not together. Yeah, they're they're divorced. They haven't gotten divorced yet, though, technically. Uh, and now I have had sex with nine different women. God. Oh. Nine. Nine? Everyone's listening. That... You showed me. I wasn't trying to show you. I was trying to move on. But I don't want to. Oh, oh, such a sticky situation. It is. Tell her she's the perfect combination of sexy and cute, asshole. You said that to her. Ooh, oh, that's, uh, that's going to sting. That was what you said to me. Robbie's failing his class. Who are you? You gotta bring this back on him. Teacher really fumbled the bag there, huh? I mean, he did the teacher pretty dirty, too. What was he doing on the back of that box? Sometimes there's like word searches on yeah. the back. <laughs> I think he was playing a game. I feel like Jacob is the type of character that would just play the word search on the back of a cereal box. Yeah. Get some silly, knowledge. Silly guy. Can we get some more Emma Stone, please? Get over here. Come on. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, Thank you. He's going to propose. Are we back at the... Ooh, dude. The, the, the Mexican what? restaurant? He calls her Hannah Banana, and he has a banana cake for her. It's so corny. So, Hannah, I would like to formally ask you if you would like to become a permanent lawyer at the firm of Watkins, Goldberg, and Schmidt. Huh? How about that? Wow. <laughs> to you. Let her answer, bro. Thought she was getting proposed to. It's a good thing. It's a good thing. I thought that you were going to propose. I need some time, I think, to figure out how I feel. Oh. About us. You know? How, oh, how is uh, he going to say that to her, bro? What? You need some time to figure out how you feel about this. Okay. Honey? <laughs> Make a scene. Wow. <laughs> oh, no, dude. Honestly, thank you very much for your job offer. I will consider it. 
Hannah banana. <laughs> <laughs> Hannah banana. Hannah banana. Still consider that job offer though, but fuck that guy. Time to go to that bar and see Jacob. You. Oh. oh, whoa, walked in and kissed him. Wow. Well, that's one way to get a girl. Absolutely just lifted her up off the ground. Still want to take me home? Yeah. He said, yeah. Yeah. Let's go. Wow. What an entrance, bro. Absolutely just stole this man away. Uh-oh. Oh, that's part of the drink, okay. Oh, he's good with drinks. That looks like a good ass drink, bro. Wow, is this guy perfect? Cheers. Jeez. Absolutely dude. just crushed that drink. Killed it. She's a drinker. Would you be annoyed if a girl just drank your drink like that or Yeah, kinda. <laughs> That you just made. I know what happens in the PG-13 version of tonight. All right, I know. It's that I get I get really drunk, and then I pass out, and you cover me with a blanket and you kiss me on the cheek. But what's gonna happen? We're not gonna get to PG-13. To bang the hot guy that hit on me at the bar. She's here to bang. Take off your shirt. Why? Please, will you take off your shirt? Because really? I can't stop thinking. And I need you just. Please just take off your shirt, Ryan Gosling. Oh my goodness. Look at this man. Oh. Fuck! <laughs> Seriously? It's like you're photoshopped. Can I? Quite the torso on him, huh? Okay, so then what do we do? What happens now? Like, logistically? What's your move? Logistically. <laughs> what's my move? What's your move? Like, what's your big move? I got lots of moves. What's your big What's move? the big move, though? We need to know the big move. Yeah, right. I work dirty dancing into the conversation. Oh. <laughs> you guys don't know yeah. dirty dancing. You know the big move at the end of dirty dancing where Patrick Swayze picks up Jennifer Grey? Yeah. I can do that. You guys don't know the move. I think I might. But it works every time. <laughs> That's that his big move. Uh oh, they're going to do it. it. <laughs> they're going to try the big move. The move. Wow. <laughs> She's gonna bang him after? I, I can't imagine being strong enough to do that to a human. You gotta be strong as like her too. Like True. you have core strength. Wow, that is a smooth transition. He's the smoothest man alive. Good, dis good discussion right now, or? Yeah, for sure. Pillow top. Is this one of those foam pillows from Brookstone? You're so awkward. Yeah. yeah. Reminds me of Zoth. Reminds me of you. You don't have one of those ridiculous foam. Those massage chairs, do you? <laughs> you do? No. Yes, you do. Yeah, I do. Yeah. <laughs> I do. I have it. How much was it? Five thousand dollars. <laughs> <laughs> A five thousand dollar massage chair. Can I sit in the massage chair? <laughs> We're here at the massage chair. I hate it. The Home Shopping Network. Yeah. But I'm a di I buy. I buy. I'm just, just hitting it off. Yeah. Do yeah. yes. you have the knife that cuts through the penny? Yeah. <laughs> he has all the the TV things. Remember the Sham Wow? Of course. And my dad cried at the spelling bee. No way. Mm -hmm. That's nice. Yeah, what word did you win on? It was so stupid. Curling up with a rich cup of coffee. Yeah, they're definitely just like yeah. having a good time with each other. He's going to like her. <laughs> I have pants just for my calves. Calf pants. <laughs> you have those, Rob. What? You have calf pants. I don't even know what calf pants will look like. Did you ever see Rob's calf pants collection be? No. Huh? I don't think I've seen it. I think you have a calf pants collection. Right? I have calf shorts. And your dad? He died a long time ago. 
he's such a sweet guy. He's probably too sweet. Uh, he said Kyle reminds me of someone. Yeah. Just too soft, too 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 sensitive. And, uh, you know, at, yep, that's, that's exactly who Cal is. He's just opening up to a complete stranger. Probably feels so good though. He tucked him. So sweet, bro. So, so wholesome. Much, so much better than that dweeb she had. Yeah, fuck that guy. And a banana. And a banana. And a banana. You want to hey. go back to bed? Hey, Jacob, it's Cal. I am imagining you suffocating under a pile of women. Oh, yeah. Hey, it's me again. Left like a hundred messages. Jacob is just absolutely ghosting him, bro. Yeah, why do you quit replying? I'd love to take you to the ballet. You'd love to go to the ballet? No, no, I didn't say that. I'd say I'd love to take you to the ballet. I would just drop you off, and then later on, I'd pick you up, and we could go to a ball game or something. Oh, I get it. <laughs> <laughs> kind of got game, too. Uh, yeah, I, I just don't want to admit it. We well, got to. He's got it. I feel like every guy in this has game. No. Oh, hi. Hi, Jess. David, this is Jessica, my babysitter. So, you know, everything looks great. Spreadsheets. <laughs> Come on. We're not fooling anybody here, Emily. Do you know that your kids are the only ones that I babysit for? They want to stay awake so that they can see their dad when he gets home. And don't get me wrong, your kids you know, your kids are really excited to see you when you get home. Oh my gosh, what is, what is this strat? <laughs> Just making her hella guilty right now. What are, what are we doing? Uh, what, what, um, I what, don't what, want your slutty money. Damn. Sweetheart, what, what's the problem? What's wrong? Oh. Slutty money. Said, I don't want your slutty money. It's crazy. That was wild. Taking the flowers? Robbie's plotting right now. For oh, real. She's gonna. Oh, no. Oh, she's taking the photo. Ugh. Jeez, so I absolutely hard. hate this. It's got his name on it. <laughs> Here he is. Doing the the yard work at night per usual. Kids? This is a little weird. And by a little, I mean weird. Just weird. Just calling because um, I'm in the basement and um, I'm trying to get the water heater working. It's a lie. <laughs> that is not true. No, no, it's fine. That's fine. Call me. I'm glad you called about this. I'll just walk you through it, okay? Okay. <clears throat> uh, so she like asked for help on stuff. Just to talk to him. Just so she can talk to him. That's adorable. Hello? Cal. Jacob. Oh my god, it's alive. I'm in a bit of a situation. I met a girl. And she is a game changer. <laughs> She's a game changer? No way. So much so I'm going to meet her mother right now. Found somebody that's gonna change Jacob. How, like, I didn't think it was possible. Do you wanna get a beer next week? You have my number. And you know, don't worry about tonight. You'll be fine. Good for you, by the way. See you, buddy. They're good Aww. friends. I love the Cal Jacob relationship. I like that little yeah cuteness going on right here. He finally found someone to lock him down. And Jacob gate primed him up for his life again. They helped each other. Photos. I know it says to Cal. Oh, this is gonna look so weird, bro. Weird's not the word I'd use. F horrific. It yeah. was more like it. Ugh. Yeah, that's not good. That is bad. That's some Has gel. his name on it. Don't show. Let me just explain it. Just hands it to him. He goes, here, you can be just as shocked as me.
All right, bro, you get the you get the picture. Uh oh. Oh, dude. No, 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 no. <laughs> Over the couch. Holy shit. What are you wearing? Dad's here. I have to blindfold you. Why? What's he doing? Just come on. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, he reminds Bernie. me of someone. Guy from the office. I am. Uh... Hey, can I take this off now, please? Nope, not yet. Oh, what's this? <laughs> I hear you get Mini golf and ballet. Oh, it's gonna be shattered by the by the Rileys. Well, we may as well wait for your daughter. She's right here. No, no, no. I mean our other daughter. Hello, Nana. Hi, guys. Oh. What? <laughs> My God. Cal. Is that him? Oh fuck. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing here? Wait, do you guys know each other? Oh. What's going on? Hey, Jacob, it's so nice to meet. <laughs> That was a twist. Oh, weren't expecting that, were you? How do you know my dad? I did not think it was her when they said Nana. Yeah, they just said Hannah Banana. Oh, they, she just said she couldn't say Hannah when she was this little. Is, uh, this is Jacob, my boyfriend. No, it's not. Oh, <laughs> he said no, it's no, not. No. Not your boyfriend. Boyfriend, can't please. I can't believe. <laughs> Seventeen. That's why we had to get married so young. That is something you should have told me. You never wanted me to talk about my children. <laughs> <laughs> You guys, like, really know each other, then. Oh, screw it. This is ridiculous. Oh, honey, he's really cute. No, he's not. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys are a thing. You guys are a couple, right? You guys are together? Yeah, yes. No way. Break up right now. <laughs> <laughs> Cal, that's not going to happen. Then I will mess you up! Oh. Cal. Cal. Jessica? Bernie? Oh, Bernie! <laughs> Let her babysit for you, you son of a God, Bernie, this is not the time, bro. What are you talking about? Oh, God, oh, God. I know what you're talking about. And now Jacob's just here? Yeah. And, oh, oh, God. That hurt him. He doesn't even know. It's your back up. No, what? No, what? Is this some kind of a skit? No, don't break it. Oh, God. What? That's a weapon. Oh, uh, oh God! It all makes sense now, bro. He doesn't even know about the naked photos. What? <laughs> what? Seriously? I'm gonna beat you until your brains fall out. Time out. Time out. I left your sweater in my car. <laughs> Dude. I'm David Linhog. David Linhagen. David Linhagen. Okay. Oh. It's a mask. Oh, oh, Jacob with the assist. When you cause my friend, you they all know. Oh, <laughs> oh no! Oh, you stay away from my daughter. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> We're all just fighting each other. All the main characters. Ah, oh, look at this crew, guys. <laughs> okay, wait. Which one of you is Lind Hagen? Hagen. 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 <laughs> it's David Lynn Hagen. Simmer down, okay? We all have arguments, but if you're gonna fight, just do it inside. Keep it in the family, okay? They are. <laughs> 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 I've seen that laugh before, surely, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's that's a meme for sure. This guy is a low life. He is a womanizer. Well, that's ironic. Hey, excuse me? You are not to see him anymore. Dad, I'm not gonna stop seeing him. Okay, okay. Well, then we have nothing more to talk about. Mm. Come on, Cal. Come on. No, Get the hell out of my house. This is not your house anymore. Yeah, well, you made damn sure of that, didn't you, sweetheart? Oh. Fuck, this is terrible, bro. Yeah. I think Lynn Hoggins still here. Oh. Go big or go home, right, bud? He doesn't like you. Go home, Dad. Damn, we've hit rock bottom, bro. This is terrible. Nice sweatsuit. What do you want? Uh, can I sit down? I don't know. Can you? <laughs> are we gonna be adults about this? Are, are we gonna, gonna be adults about this? <laughs> <laughs> no, that, that's that's the answer. The answer is no. It would mean a lot to me if we could talk. Are you still seeing my daughter? Yes. I have nothing to say to you. You've been hanging out here a lot. Sometimes. 
Cal's life is bad right now, bro. He has no one. Your kids miss you, Cal. You're hanging out with my kids? That's great. You can teach Robbie how to objectify women. He'll love that. Damn, bro. Come on. You know he's, that's not what he's... That's not the only thing he does. Is the parental advice over? Because if so... I'm in love with her. Oh, wow. Jacob. I believe you. I don't know what I was doing before this. And I don't know what to do about it. It's not something I can really stop. You love her? You love Hannah? Yes. Tell me about it. I looked at people who were in love, and I thought the way that they were behaving and the things that they were doing and saying, they just, they appeared pathetic. He's totally changed his tune. Totally new Jacob. I had Hannah when I was 17. I taught her how to ride a bike. Are. Crazy perspective. I understand why Cal would be so concerned. Yeah. I think it's fantastic that you're a better man. I know. No, I know. I know too much. I know. I know. And it's Hannah, and she's too good for you. I agree. <sighs> Breaks my heart. You're a good dad, Cal. Ugh. That's a bummer. Friendship over. All my life, I wanted to grow up. But it's all a scam. And love, that's the biggest scam of all. Oh my gosh. Ah, took a bad turn. What a speech. Isn't it supposed to be happy? There is no such thing as one true Stop! Life. Oh, jeez. God, dude. This is the worst place for this to happen. Oh boy. Oh man. Oh no. Gosh. We just leave. What are you doing? I was wrong. I uh I can't watch, bro. I can't look at this. I'm shit. loving this. I'm eating this shit up. Here's the thing. My son's graduation speech sucks. <laughs> I met my soulmate when I was 15 years old. We went out for ice cream. After my dad started teasing me about my first date, the way dads do, it's no big deal. I'm gonna be going out with a lot of different girls on a lot of different dates. And that is the first time that I ever lied to my father. <laughs> the daughter just <laughs> absolutely <laughs> n doing nothing. She's there. I have loved her even when I've hated her. Only married couples will understand that one. Steve Carell's winning the crowd over. <laughs> I mean, it's not his show, is it? This is about Robbie. Ste he's stealing his show. I know. I will never stop trying. Because when you find the one, you never give up. Well, Robbie really took that one to heart, huh? <laughs> yeah, he's like, I gave up. I still love there you, we Jessica. Go. We know. We all know. And I love you, Emily. Ryan, Ryan, Ryan loves me. Uh oh. Oh God, no. What were you doing, Robbie? I'm still not ashamed of it. Okay, we're good. We're good. Should be. Should be ashamed. <laughs> Should be ashamed. There she is. Perfect girl. <laughs> the menacing look. So I bought a firearm. <laughs> <laughs> a shady internet site, and I am prepared to shoot you in the face. Ah, <laughs> oh, we're good. Take care of her. Oh, <laughs> revenge. This is gonna be fun. This is gonna be fun. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta get him back, bro. You can't do it now. I'm gonna go talk to my friends. Yeah, go hang with the other high schoolers. Go ahead. See if I is Riley gonna here. give him a kiss, Bryce? Huh? Who the fuck is Who's Riley? Who the fuck Jessica. is Riley? <laughs> it's their last name. It's their last name. It's their last name. Oh, look at her. That's his love. Dude, I swear I used to have this kid's same haircut. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say that. <laughs> <laughs> I said that to you, Robbie. 
Okay. I mean, when I was like 12. Yeah, yeah. Like, that's what I was talking about. Didn't know me when I was 12. <laughs> well, I thought you weren't giving up. I'm not. And I just figure you like my dad. And in a few years, I'll look like him. True. Big brain Robbie moves. Well, until then, just a little graduation gift to get you through high school. Shut up. <laughs> Shut oh the my. fuck up. Oh my god, bro. Oh. <laughs> this kid is on cloud nine right now. That is a crazy gift. What a gift. Wild. Dude, like, are you kidding me? <laughs> One of the more wild things I've seen. <laughs> yeah, pretty crazy, honestly. What do you got in your hand, son? <laughs> These are supposed to be yours, Dad. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> They're so good together. What a hap like, How awesome is that that he gets to join the fam? I'm so glad you bought me that ice cream. Ah. Oh. Me oh, sweet. Me hot. They're soulmates. Forever. That's what I do. I go like this when I cry. <laughs> Robbie was way bigger of a character than I thought he would be. <laughs> yeah, pretty, for real. Pretty big character. <laughs> Look at him. Dude. What? <laughs> he had the last, He's the, the last, last thing we saw. <laughs> All right. That was crazy stupid love. Just as good as I remember it mm -hmm. being. Really holds up, I think. I, I love that movie. It was very good. I enjoyed it a lot. I think Steve Carell was absolutely killed it this movie. He was so good. Yeah, that, I mean, Ryan Gosling. All of them did, too. really. Ryan Gosling and Steve mm -hmm. Carell were definitely the shining stars, though. They, I honestly they thought were sweet. Little Robbie was really good, too. He played a good. I think out of all, like, Emma Stone probably got the least amount of, like, time on the screen in this movie. She wasn't in it much. She was stuck in her Hannah Banana relationship. Yeah, I feel like that's just m mostly due to they had to hide the fact that she's yeah their yeah. daughter, which I think they do a great job of it. Yeah, like, I had the first absolutely no. The clue. first time I watched it, I had no clue either. Uh, but I mean, looking back, they they yeah. mentioned Nana a bunch, and her name's Hannah, and they explained she just couldn't say Hannah when she was little. So and all the girls adopted, have red hair. Adopted the nickname Nana. Yeah, and and her mom. And her have the same exact hair color, but yeah, I I, I think um, the one thing that kind of falls short with the rom coms is the comedy sometimes. Like sometimes yeah. they're not as funny as they think that they are. And this one, I just uh -huh. every joke landed. It's because like. it's Steve Carell, bro. Yeah, he yeah. Just Ryan so Gosling funny. was so funny too. He was funny too. It was so ev like oh my goodness. But Steve Carell's just so funny when he tells a joke and mm -hmm. when he's the butt of, jo butt yeah. of the joke. Like great, he takes a joke really I well. Mean, he is just an absolute A plus comedian. Mm -hmm. like, yeah. One of my so favorite good. things about him though is like as soon as like he's just absolute goofball funny but whenever it needs to be serious he can just mm -hmm. go to serious and make you feel like actual real emotions that's why like i know we talk about the office a lot though but bryce you would it's just a, on another level compared to anything else i really like the the like relationship between cal and jacob the they're just polar opposites in the beginning but they both learn from each other and like adopt habits from one another that both like makes them better people like cal found his manhood again and like kind of found who he was and then jacob like learned how to not just view women as objects and yeah. to learn to love and like open up his heart i think that's cool i don't know i think i really really like the the friendship between them I honestly mm. think more so Hannah taught him that, not Cal. I guess so, yeah. Because Cal was just trying to be like him. He didn't really like give him any tips. I think it was Hannah's like quirkiness and like how she was all like nervous and like mm -hmm. like transparent with him. They just like absolutely hit it off that night, and he was like, "Holy fuck, this this is better than just yeah hit, hitting and quitting," as as Zuff would say. So. I absolutely love seeing Cal like at first trying to get with the girls or like oh, oh so funny to talk them. His game was bad at the beginning. I was surprised when he. I thought the teacher was so funny. Yeah, she was a funny. She was character. also pretty good looking. Like, Marissa that was, Tomei. That was, her, that was the second girl Cal ever had sex with. She's <laughs> she is the aunt from. Isn't it Aunt May? Aunt May from the yeah. Spider -Man, the Marvel Spider Man movies for sure. One of my favorite scenes is definitely like at the end when they find David Lindhagen shows up 
and everyone knows who David Lindhagen is, yeah. and Jacob's just like, oh, let me take the rings off for this one. Just <laughs> absolutely sucker punches him. Such a good payoff. I, I love the just throughout the whole movie they the David Lindhagen joke. It's funny. I know there were, he, they said his name so many times. I know, dude. You I'm just, gonna know that name. I'm gonna be saying. I'll like, never right forget when I'm it. Dying. I'm gonna be like David, David Lindhagen. Lindhagen. You're gonna no, say I'm gonna, I'm gonna Hagen. Say, I'm gonna say David Lindhagen. Hagen. Hagen. And then Hagen. my wife's gonna be like Hagen. Hagen. And then you're gonna die. And then you're gonna die. That's how you die. What, what's your wife doing there? Letting him die. Just natural causes or what? Yeah. Where are you at? On the beach. Dying on the beach from natural causes. After a shark bought my hand. <laughs> so okay, not so natural it's causes. completely changed now. Yeah. After a shark bought his hand. <laughs> How much did he pay? <laughs> <laughs> I thought the ending to that movie was so good. Like I was saying when it happened, when Jessica gave Robbie those pictures, that was one of the craziest it's things. It's so, a weird twist. It was so crazy. I don't know about that. She goes, here's this. Good luck. But I'll see school. you in a few years, and I'm going to kiss you on the cheek. But here's me fully naked. Yeah. Multiple times. Very strange. Oh, no. What, the parents get for the give dad. that back or what? Yeah, they're like, here, you can have these back. Like, what? I don't know if the, the relationship between Cal and Bernie can be repaired. <laughs> like, he didn't do anything wrong, but it's shit's just weird he was now, kind of bro. Real man's at the beginning. Yeah. He, well, he said he picked Cal, but his wife didn't let him. Yeah. There was, I, I love the love stories in this, though. You don't usually see someone getting back, like, with. From like a divorce situation yeah like it's always like yeah, done for, for a while i did not want him to get back with her i was just loving that yeah the, I, the single lifestyle i think by the end of it you realize that they are better together yeah and for sure i don't know i'm i'm happy with the decision that they're back i do i'm i'm glad they're back i didn't want him though when he was having fun definitely yeah i i think he he did what he did and he got it out of he his system he needed to get his manhood back and he did that's just it it honestly is like super crazy like the amount of time that he spent with jacob and the things that they did together and it's just like oh here be in this committed relationship with my daughter like oh that's yeah just, yeah. like get, in the I back get... of your head you have to always be thinking about yeah, yeah this guy is a player like mm -hmm. he is a womanizer a womanizer so I, I i fully understood where he was coming from he might have been a bit dramatic about it yeah, but uh i i understand his point of view his perspective of the situation i'm glad they're good they were they yeah were awesome duo yeah they i'm have some fun times i think the them being like a father-in-law son-in-law is just it makes it better like i don't know i need a crazy stupid love too never For gonna sure. happen never gonna happen all right, guys, well, that is it for this movie. If you do like all of our movie reactions, please leave a like, drop a comment, and subscribe. Check out all the links in our description as well. First one's going to be for our Patreon. We have the full uncut reactions to this movie, as well as all of our other movies over there. So check that out. Second link is going to be for our Discord. Come talk to us about Crazy Stupid Love and all the other movies that we watch. We're in there all the time. We have a super dope community, so stop by, chat with us. The rest of the links are going to be for all of our social medias. Give us a follow, and at the very bottom, you will see the address to our PO box. Send us something to be opened up on camera like everything you see behind us right now and with all that being said guys we will see you next time for our next movie peace out